Ritualistic killing takes pleasure in it. Significant care exhibited at the crime scene. All the hallmarks of a serial killer. Yeah, but I've never seen this MO. Hey, bad news. The feds struck out on the symbol. It bears some similarities to some ancient alchemy signs, but they've never seen this one before. So we're back to square one. Not necessarily. Uh, Tessa's roommate said that he gave her some jewelry. Maybe he left a fingerprint on one of those pieces. I'll head to her place, see what I can find out. Jewelry? I never would have thought of that. I guess I'll have to remind you when my birthday's coming up. Why, Detective Beckett, was that a hint you just dropped? Why, Mr. Castle, I do believe it was. Shameless. Yo, Beckett, you got a second? I need a word. Okay, so... What's up? We have the CSU report back. Mm -hmm. The inside of Tessa's apartment was wiped clean. Yeah, well, we expected that. No, we didn't expect this. CSU were able to pull prints off the outside doorknob and from around the door frame. And they found a set that didn't match Tessa's or her roommates. When they ran it, they found it matched someone else in the system. Okay, who? Richard Castle. You know what, it, it was probably just an accident. He probably touched them on his way in before putting his gloves on. Yeah, I mean, that would explain it. Except that CSU collected them before either of you arrived. 